Good day, students and members of the Information System and Technology Society. Um, this is the Research Innovation Technology Officer, Mohamed Kubo Masakoy. And of course, as you know, our tenure in office is due. And according to the Constitution, there should be an online voting system. And uh, in IT and IS Society, we believe in democracy. We are elected, we are not me actually, but our president, um, um, Francis Fumba Sisi, and that of the Sergeant Ishmael Ba, we are elected um, uh, through an online voting system. So it is our responsibility to also give you that platform so you guys can do the same and you know vote for people that you think are competent, that are going to take after us. So um, with that being said, um, as you can see, we have two um, positions, which is the president and that of the secretary general. And for the president, we have two candidates, and also the secretary general we have two candidates. The president, we have Sir Joseph Sandi and uh, Abdul Salam Kane Kumara. And for the secretary general, we have uh, uh, Musa Wahab Kamara and Ahmed Salam Kanu. So these are the Candidate, these are your aspirants for this year's election. Um, so let me just try to take it through on how the system is going to work, or in which way you guys um, are going to cast your vote. So this is just like a guide to walk you through on the system. So now um, I'm going to try to add voter. Of course, let me just see it down. That's my name, Kuba Masakoi. And my student ID is 27267. Okay. And for the email, I'm going to use my professional name, which is info um, at kubahost.com. And by the way, kubahost is one of the best web hosting, if not the best web hosting in Sierra Leone um, so therefore and, and also this system is, is hosted in that platform so it just tells you that it is 99.9% .9 uptown so there is no need for you to worry about um, the system being hacked so it's 100% secure okay so let me just save this and see okay so now we have one um, registered member so this is this, as I told you guys, this is just a test case. We have one um, voter, which is my very self, Mohamed Masakoi. Now I'm going to send um, the email. Okay. Now the email is sent successfully. Let me just check my phone. Let me check. Let me check. Okay. So let me just check my phone now. Um... Okay, so let me just check my phone. Let me check my phone. Okay. Um, let me wait. Okay. Now I have the email. See? It says I, I, IS and IT Society Election. So you click. Um, it says IS and IT Society Election. Hello, Kuba. This is your voter ID. Of course, this is my voter ID. Then I'm um, use it and your student ID to log in into your voter panel. Election, of course, um, the voting ends at 4 p.m. Um, you can vote using this link. So all I have to do is just to click on the link. I'm going to click on the link. So when you click on the link, it's going to take you to the landing page. Let me see. Um, it's going to take you to the landing page. Still waiting. I just pray my internet will be fast and uh, still. Wait. Okay. Now this is the landing page. Of course, if you have time, you can go through it. Um, you see, information technology, information system and technology, blah blah blah. If you have time, you can read this. You know, we have I I S and I T sites election data. Of course, we have um, uh, two hundred and fifty-five registered students. We have four candidates. 
um, meaning two two candidates um, for the presidential and two for the Secretary General. Uh, yeah, we have election observers which are going to be six. That is um, uh, two from each candidate, and uh, we have position which is that of the president and the Secretary. So as I said, if you have time, you can just go through all of this. But your focus should be on vote now. So just click on vote now. Click on vote now. Um, this will display. Let me let me get my voter ID. So I'm going to come again and copy this. Copy my voter ID. Go again to my browser. Um, paste. Now, but if you see, just after the capital B, there is some space. So I have to click one more. See back. Now I believe it's open. Then I input my um, my student ID, which is two seven two. Six seven, I believe. Then sign in and see. Okay, see. So this is just simple um, and straightforward. So we have for the president. Um, we have two, which is the um, uh, Sir Joseph Sambi and um, Abdul Salam King Kumara, and of course the second we have Musa and that of Ahmed. So um, this, I'm not. I just want to select one. This is just a test, so I'm not campaigning for anyone here, and I don't think I even know any one of them. I've never met this aspirant, so there is no way I can favor anyone. So, but but for the test sake, I'm just going to click on Sir Joseph Sandy. I'm going to vote for Sir Joseph Sandy. And um, please use your own discretion. Vote for someone that you believe in is going to take this society to another level, please. Um, then for. For second, I'm just going to go with Ahmed. Okay, and uh, you can see right um, uh, just before um, getting to the footer, you can see it says position one candidate. Don't worry about that. Um, they're going to see that they're going to they're going to display for you um, the, the candidate won the election um, after we have pronounced them. We have announced them as winners. Okay, so now I click on vote. Okay. So you see, now say successful. Of course, you have cast your vote. Um, you have cast your vote. They say you have already. Now this is a real time. You can see here it says um election ends at this at now this is three days to the election. Now the election is going to end um four four p.m. So as soon as this um as soon as the the time um uh, it reaches to four p.m. they are automatically this whole system is going to close you can use your login credential and come but all you can see is just maybe the, the, the winners but and of course this is one time when you vote there is no way you are going to vote oh my god okay there is no way you are going to vote for like the same candidate twice or so so now okay you can also view view your ballot probably you made a mistake or so um uh, sergeant yeah sergeant yourself so these are the candidates that i voted for so basically i believe this is all you have to so let me try to log out let me try to log out and see. So you see, log out and use my credential. Let me try to use the same credential again and see if it's going to allow me to vote. Six, seven. Um, login. You see, it says um, you have already voted. So there's no way I can vote twice. Okay, so let me just, I believe this one is okay. And uh, let me go back to the system. Let me go back to the system. Let me go. Oh my God. Let me, let me go back to the system. Now, um, come to vote. You see? Um, of course. We have one total number of votes, of course, you only have one, then that of number of votes, and so and these are the people that I voted for. So now let me try to send the report. Now I'm going to send the report. Of course, if I send the report, then Sergeant, this is going to be the winner, and for the president, this Sami guy is going to be the winner. Now I'm going to send the report. Send, you see? The report is sent. So let me, let me try to go again and see. Um, let me go again and see. So using the same credentials, now I'm going to use again 27267, login, okay, 
Now if I try to refresh, of course I'm not going to vote again, but it's going to give me, see? Now we're going to tell the president, uh, uh, um, position president, the gathers have voted for one election, which is what, which is, uh, um, who is, um, uh, Sir Joseph Sandy, and of course for the surgeon, Ahmed won the, um, uh, the surgeon position. So I believe so far so good. This is all I have to share with you guys. If you have any question concerning the system, um, the credibility or the security, whatever question you may have, please ask me or you can ask um, our president, um, Fumba, or that of the, um, the secretary. So thank you guys.